Welcome to the World Drone Market Channel. Today we're bringing you a wiring tutorial video on how to connect the SkyDroid C13 to the SkyDroid H16. SkyDroid C13 is a 3-axis gimbal that integrates a 5-megapixel visible light camera, a 640 thermal imaging sensor and a laser rangefinder. SkyDroid H16 Drone Remote Controller is an all-in-one drone remote control solution for long-range HD video transmission, which can realize video, data transmission and radio control, featuring low latency, good anti-interference performance and long transmission range. The video is divided into three main parts. What products are used in this test? How to connect the wiring? How to display the video feed? What products are used in this test? The products used are SkyDroid C13 Gimbal Camera, SkyDroid H16 Remote Controller, Tattoo 11.1 V Battery. Cables used are Ethernet Power Cable and SkyDroid H16 Receiver SBUS Plus BATA Cable. How to connect the wiring? Connect the POW Plus LAN interface of C13 to the LAN interface of the SkyDroid H16 Receiver. The connector on the C13 side is GH1.257 pin while the connector on the H16 receiver side is GH1.255 pin. Power on the SkyDroid H16 receiver first, then power on the C13 gimbal camera. How to display the video feed. Turn on the remote controller and enter the gimbal FPV software. If no image is displayed after entering, click the toggle button at the bottom menu, find the C13 icon and click to enter. The first icon is for recording, the second is for taking photos, the third is for enabling floating window, and then we go to the fourth one parameter settings. Image parameters allow you to set related camera image settings. Gimbal Control offers target tracking and three control modes. Multiple options can be selected at the same time. Dome effect calibration is done before leaving the factory. Due to its special calibration method, please do not calibrate on your own unless necessary. Contact our technical support before attempting calibration. AI Gimbal allows the gimbal to lock on a selected object.
Gimbal calibration is done at the factory. If there are no gimbal issues, do not click this option. Working mode allows you to set the gimbal as upright or inverted. Please place the gimbal correctly based on the selected mode. Incorrect placement may damage the gimbal motor. Gimbal speed has constant speed mode and variable speed mode. Palette lets you adjust thermal imaging display effects, with a total of 11 options available. Click Settings to set encoding mode. You can also flip the image, check camera version number, and set OSD display. Crosshair. Reversing line. Switch connection. Laser rangefinder allows single laser measurement by clicking the measure button. Effective range is 5M to 1 km. Side buttons. One click downward view. A centering. Global Centering, Zoom Adjustment, then go into Settings again. The first video URL is for C13 Visible Light. The second is for C13 Thermal Imaging. Copy the URLs. Open QGC. Click Application Settings under General Settings. Set the video type to RTSP Video Stream. Paste the video URL. Go back to Flight Screen to see the C13 video feed. The thermal imaging URL uses the same method. Then open Yunjua's ground station fly GSIS. Click the top left corner, then Common Settings, then Other Settings, enter User Interface. Select Video Window, choose C13. and the ground station will display the E13 feed. This concludes the video tutorial on connecting and displaying the SkyDroid C13 gimbal camera with the SkyDroid H16 remote controller. In this tutorial, we introduced the required equipment and cables, the standard wiring method, and how to view the video feed and make related settings using the SkyDroid H16 controller and its ground station. Thank you for watching and supporting us. If you have any questions about the video content or want us to dive deeper into specific topics in future videos, feel free to leave a comment. Don't forget to follow the World Drone Market channel. We will continue to bring you more reviews, tutorials, and user guides on drone equipment. See you in the next video.